Our beliefs create our thoughts, and our thoughts create our feelings, and our feelings create our behavior, and our behavior creates our results. And so if you want anything to change on the results level, don't just go to the behaviors or the feelings or even the thoughts. We need to go deeper to our beliefs because if we can handle that, everything changes. Be focused, be determined, be hopeful, be empowered. Empower yourselves with a good education. Then get out there and use that education to build a country worthy of your boundless promise. Lead by example with hope, never fear. You don't want to be the stupidest guy in the room. It's a bloody rough place to be. So, and you probably don't want to be the smartest guy in the room either, because what that probably means is you should be in a different room, right? You should look at a place where if you're right at the top, it's, you've mastered it. It's time to go somewhere where you're a little lower so that you've got something to climb up for. When a man does not feel appreciated in the area of his presence, he becomes a version of a man that he can give you and still survive. And I promise you, you will not like that version. That version of him is silent, frustrated, sharp with his words, non-communicative, because he has to become something that he can survive in. I think as human beings, everybody has a natural gift and a natural passion, but then you go outside and you get influenced and you, and you feel pressure from, from what's going on outside. And so, you know, I read one time, like, would you rather be at war with yourself and at peace with the world or at peace with yourself and at war with the world? And that was powerful for me. So I want to I want to say congratulations to all the girls in this world who are strong, who are confident. And yes, we have insecure moments and that's OK. But guess what? You do something that millions of people would never be able to do if they had the opportunity because it takes guts. It takes balls. If you don't feel strong every day, that's okay, and it's normal. And every day, something new can inspire you, and a small thought or idea or action can change the course of your day, your week, your month, your year. You're never alone, and you're never stuck, no matter how down you feel. If you want something, if you have a passion in your heart, fire in your belly, it's going to be you. It's gonna be you getting up early. It's gonna be you staying up late. It's gonna be you running the miles and, and going to the gym and eating the kale and doing all the crap that you don't, it's only gonna be you. I want women to feel confident no matter what size they are, no matter what shade of blue they are, no matter what their personality is, what their race is, their religion is. I want women to feel confident and sexy because that's who we are and we deserve to be like that. Life is too short to sit anywhere other than where you're supposed to be. And if you're sitting at a table where you don't feel like you're being fed, even if you're bringing a plate of food, you politely just leave. The decisions you make in life don't always define the person you become. Mm -hmm. um, I believe that every day when you wake up, you can decide how that day goes. Mm -hmm. And it doesn't have to be the same as the day before. Mm -hmm. Just think everything that you do helps you learn something. Mm -hmm. Everything's a lesson. Life is like a boomerang. If you're good, good things will always come back to you. Think positively, speak positively. Nothing is impossible if you believe. I have to have a great relationship with myself to have good relationships with other people. My friends, you know, my romantic partners, my child, you know, my colleagues, like whatever. It's like, you can't have the relationships if you don't have a good one with yourself. Please take care of yourself and be good to yourself and be nice to yourself. Don't take that extra step and hurt yourself further then you can't and you can't take it back when you have the vision and you're able to manifest but then you also put the work in magic happens man magic that's where the magic is but a lot of people never get there unfortunately a lot of people are, we're blessed that we can dream i get eight hours of sleep i prioritize it i am very um focused on it and 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 the, for me i need eight hours of sleep i think better I have more energy, my mood is better, all these things. And think about it, as a senior executive, you get paid to make a small number of high quality decisions. And they should just be as high quality as I can make them. Warren Buffett says he's good if he makes three good decisions a year. My high school English teacher, Mr. Fisk, uh, actually paid attention one time in class. And, and he said, he had this beautiful quote, and, he, and it read, rest at the end, not in the middle. And I took that to heart. I believe there's time for resting at the end, 
But for me, that time is not now. I have a dream, sacrifice for it, and never ever rest in the middle. Anticipate the wall, you're going to hit it. And in those moments, whatever you tell yourself, if you convince yourself that the difficulty you're facing is harder than everybody else's and you buy it, you will stay where you're at. But if you convince yourself that whatever you wall you've hit, other people have overcome it and so can you, you go through that wall, wall as well. This thing, you're doing it for yourself. You're not doing it for anybody else. Yes, your family supports you. Yes, your friends support you, but you're doing it for yourself at the end of the day. And you're the only one who's going out there. You gotta motivate yourself and you gotta want it as much as everybody else on the track. So I've learned that so it's easier now. So when people say, this season all you're saying is not running as fast as you should, it doesn't bother me because I've been through this already and I know what they're gonna say all the time. But I know what I'm capable of and I know what I can do, so. Your body's a lot stronger than your brain sometimes. And you gotta catch your brain up. Your muscles will be ready to keep going. Your brain will have its limit. You know what I'm saying? And be like, I can't do no more. And then your body will follow suit. But when you can break the mental barriers, you'll be, you'll notice, damn, I can do way more. I was crazy. You know what I'm saying? I had way more in me. So I think that's an example of like feeling like you can't, like you're exhausted or you, you about to, you know, you overwhelmed. And then being clear that, you know, this is how I feel to be pushing yourself more than you ever have, demanding more. You know, that's just the natural way it feel when you, when you press your line and press yourself to produce more and to be better, you know what I'm saying? Your lack of commitment is almost an insult to the people who believe in you. And that's what I'm trying to tell myself. I said, there's people, in, there's people who believe in me, so this is what I'm telling myself right now, this, today. There's people that believe in me and, and me having this half commitment. It's not what the f I am. It's that's not what right. my people, it's not what the right. people who, who believe in me deserve. And I want to, you know, I want to I wanna give back to the people who believe in me and, and give them that belief, you know, and, and prove that belief correct, so. No matter what you face, no matter how bad it is going to be when there is a challenge anything that you're facing the only way to overcome the challenges that you face is to start walking take that step every day no matter what you are facing get up and start walking. I just had a dream to become something. That's the thing about dreaming. Just eight years ago, I was crossing the Mediterranean to make it from Africa to Europe. Then I was homeless in Paris, sleeping in the street. If you believe in yourself, you can be your own hero or hero to somebody else. Keep dreaming. Keep fighting. Knowing what it is about you that is infectious and, and being able to convey that to people as soon as you meet them is so important. Being memorable and, and making an impact is so important. Um, you know, in so that's true for so many different lines of work and not just like as an actor, but you have to do things to stand out. You can't play by the rules. And um, I think that, yeah, just knowing that you're good enough and making sure that you stay on that path to, to be that person. Take a negative and turn it into a positive. Don't be afraid to fail. People don't see that. People will never understand that. To be success, you know, all they think about, well, he batted 202, you know, and he struck out a certain number of times. Yeah, okay. You know, but the effort was there and the learning curve and the passion was there that has transcended not just to me, but to other people who are afraid to do things because they're worried about the perception that may come from other places. To me, that's more gratifying uh, than anything. If I leave here with anybody liking me, I fail. You understand what I'm saying? I fail. I'm not here to be your friend. You want a friend, go get a 
Oh, no. I'm here to drag your sorry ass across the goal line, no matter what it takes. And there's no better on the planet than me at doing it, as demonstrated by all the tens of billions that created. <laughs>